Happy November 2nd, everyone. I'm Liam, and we are playing the 2024 quest calendar, The Leaf Riders of Renwood. Yesterday, Enid Sagebloom, Queen of Crown Spire, passed away. That leaves me wondering if you are playing Korra. She's one of the characters you can play here. Where is she? There she is. If you're playing Korra, who is the princess, uh, and I'm not aware that she has any siblings, are you now the queen? Uh, and I wonder how the calendar will handle that. In any case, amidst everything else going on in Crown Spire, the city is now in deep mourning. Queen Enid was beloved, and she will be sorely missed. And that is where we left things. So, let's see what adventure is on the calendar for us today. The city is saddened, but much is needed to prepare for the ceremony. Perhaps you can earn some coin by helping the citizens. There's a few things we can do here. It says, choose any number of jobs you'd like to perform. Some may be risky, as well as rewarding. We can coordinate floral arrangements. We can, uh, there is a grieving citizens support group. And, uh, or, and or we could assist with security. So, let's do it all. Coordinate final, uh, floral arrangements. Roll d20 plus wisdom. 15 plus 2 wisdom is 17. That's the best result. Uh, gathering and arranging the appropriate flowers and greenery for the funeral can be meticulous. You need to coordinate with local florists and even navigate the forest to find specific rare blooms. Now the best result here says local florists work seamlessly with your vision. And your search in the forest yields an abundance of rare and exquisite blooms. The arrangements are respectful and exceptionally beautiful, providing comfort and solace to the grieving family. Collect four amber. That takes us to 65. All right. Grieving Citizen Support Group. Well, D20 plus Charisma. 14 plus 2 charisma is 16. That's also going to be the best result. Ivy is sort of notoriously bad at these <laughs> odd jobs. We're doing um, uncharacteristically well today. Numerous critters are in mourning, grappling with grief and loss. They gather in a support group, seeking solace and emotional assistance. You lend your support by offering comfort and understanding to those who are grieving. And now the best result says you connect deeply with the grieving critters. Your words of comfort and empathy resonate profoundly, offering solace to those in pain. The support group begins to heal, finding strength in each other's company and your guidance. You collect three amber. That takes us to 68 amber. And lastly, assist with security. Roll d20 plus intellect. Reminder, student. That's unusual. Six plus two intellect is eight. Um, we are not a student, but we have Ivan who might be able to help us. And if we can get one more point, we'll get the middle result. So let's see if Ivan can help us out here. What does he need? Ivan. A heart or a spade? And he'll get us two points. There we go. Nope. <laughs> it's a club. So, that's no good. What was it? It was intellect. We do have a foresight flower. We also have Seskel. Seskel can help us. He can get us d6 intellect if we draw a club or a spade greater than or equal to 5. And you know what? That's what we drew. Um, so, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to apply that to Seskel instead. I'm going to let Ivan draw here again. And he gets it. Excellent. So, we actually get plus 2. And then um, Sesco gets us another six. That's eight. That get, gets us a 16. I think that gets us to the best result. So back to Ivy. And back to assisting with security. Yep, that's the best result. With the funeral expected to draw a large crowd and high tensions, ensuring security and a peaceful ceremony is paramount your task is to assist in organizing and coordinating security measures such as placing guards setting up checkpoints and monitoring the crowd 
Okay, and the best result now says guards are strategically positioned, checkpoints are efficiently run, and the crowd is closely monitored. Your meticulous planning should ensure a peaceful and secure environment for the funeral. Gain two amber and gain a plus two bonus on all rolls on the next page. Okay, that makes me think there's going to be some kind of security event taking place tomorrow. But what do we get? We got two amber, so we go to 70, and we get plus two bonus to all rolls. Uh, the next page is going to be November 4th. Number four. Okay. Um, it is a Saturday and a Sunday, so we can play the Sunday lottery. And we're in town here, so we head down to the Sunday lottery office and we pay to Amber. Oh, <laughs> we pay to Amber to play and we lose it. <laughs> uh, and so we're back down to 68 Amber just like that so 68 and that my friends is november 2nd and 3rd so we shall say goodbye for now and visit ivy and friends again on monday i hope you'll join us thanks for watching <laughs>